Okay, now, we're getting ready to turn our manometer on. The first button push is going to be, obviously, the on button. Of, if you want to turn on your light so you can see it, you can do that. That's fine. Okay, now, there's five main button pushes to get the DG700 set up to perform the blower door test. Okay, we're going to press mode, mode, baseline, start. Okay, now you're going to see the timer over here to the right start its countdown. What it's doing is it's going to get us a good baseline reading from outside to inside. After 10 seconds, it's going to click that says, hey, you know, we are ready. Uh, you can push it right at 10 seconds. You can let it go for a better average. Okay, we're now ready to push enter. Okay, now we are set up to perform our blower door test. What, what we want to look for is we're going to see adjusted PA, that means adjusted Pascal, because that's uh, how we're going to um, get a, a uh, good pressure measurement once we start our test. That's what we're going to measure in is Pascals. Okay? Over here to the right, we're going to see CFM at a negative 50 Pascals. That's what we're going to read, and that's going to be our main goal is to get this good reading over here.